So you might be trying to figure out how you can go through and split screen multitask on your M5 iPad Pro. Nowadays, it's a little bit different because before we could drag and drop the apps, I guess that's not really working every time now. The best way to do this is by setting up the windowed approach. So let's go and make our way over to our iPad settings. Tap on multitasking and gestures, which is right here. And what I recommend doing is you can have it either as, you know, full screen apps, windowed apps, or stage manager. For my favorite one, I'd probably recommend doing windowed apps. But you can also go through and do, you know, full screen apps if you want the original type of approach. Then what you can do is you can go ahead and start opening up some applications. So let's go and open up our internet browser. What you will see is a little option in the bottom right. It's a little like indicator. What you can do is you can go through and you can go ahead and drag this indicator down or up and kind of make it as big or as small as you want to. So you can go through and drag this indicator up just like this, make it as big or small as you want to. And this is actually a window now. So now what you can do is you can drag this window to the side. And what then I can do is I can go drag to the bottom and drag another application if I want to. And then I can drag this one over, right? I can make this one smaller as well. And now look, I pretty much had these two applications windowed side by side. And now I'm basically getting these like two applications that I can kind of use. Now, I actually prefer this approach a little bit more because they're actually like full on windows and you can see they actually overlap to one another. So now you can use this one here, you can use this one there. If you wanna go back to your original split screen though, you can always go through and go back to full screen apps right here. And you can go back to your standard type of, you know, uh, multitasking just like that. And then if you want to, you can go through and just like before, you can kind of drag and drop an application if you want to. And that should go through and give you the same type of capability as well. So that pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Solon.